This new study examines the prevalence of self-reported comorbidities, assesses the association between self-reported comorbidities and functional improvements, and identifies other important predictors of physical therapy outcomes. Identifying these comorbidities and understanding their impact on recovery may help workers' compensation stakeholders better understand which low back pain cases are more likely to have poor outcomes and potentially adapt treatments for workers with high-risk comorbidities. Up until this study, there was little information regarding the prevalence of comorbidities among workers with injuries because comorbidities are typically under-identified in workers' compensation claims data. Let me show you how this report is organized. Go to the table of contents on page four. First, you have an executive summary on page eight, which gives you a boiled down synopsis of all the most important findings in the study. Chapter one is an introduction. Chapter two discusses the data and methods used to study this topic. Chapter three, we present the prevalence of comorbidities and answer whether there are differences in functional recoveries. In chapter four, we discuss other important predictors of functional recoveries, including age, acuity, and function at the beginning of physical therapy, among others. In chapter five, we discuss the implications of this study as well as future research on the topic. We hope you found this video helpful and will download the report. If you did like this video, please click on the thumbs up button below. Also, please make sure to subscribe to our channel to stay up to date with our latest research and discussions about important workers' compensation topics. Thanks for watching.